Nah. You said no. Nah. You've had me work the whole time and now you think I should be ready. Are you for real? You're really saying no, you're rejecting me. You're rejecting my advances. Okay, so I thought I'd make a video. Oh. Have you got the poo bags? You've got the poo Why bags. do I always have to pick up the poo? Because you're the one making the documentary. But you say I'll pick it up wrong, so why don't you do it? You've got the camera, so don't, no, I'll pick it up. Don't. Do it slowly, poo. because now... Oh, you're the greatest poo picker Yeah, but do it slowly, because now you're leaving some behind. There is no art to picking up poo, Drew, okay? You just pick it up and go. No, do it slowly. Can we just get on If you're doing before? a documentary about... My subscribers, will you please shut up? If you're doing a documentary about pollution, dog poo is pollution, so you should Well, I'm showing properly. the people that the right thing to do is to pick up the poo, okay? Now, will you please just shut up? Are we getting going or not? To my subscribers, hi, it's Barry, okay? This is in, in the middle of Brisbane and Ipswich. It's a beautiful place. The only problem is, and I would like to highlight the problem, is that there's too much pollution and too much plastic bags and rubbish just left all over the place that nobody ever picks up. What my partner and I do here, you know Drew behind the camera. Say hi Drew. Hi. What my partner and I often do is come here in the mornings and we pick it up ourselves. Um, because we would like to do good for the community, we would like to do good for the marine life because it's the marine life I feel most sorry for. Um, because it has happened that many turtles, many um, fish, um, many, many other such like marine life get caught up, birds, lots of birds get caught up in these plastic bags. What are you doing? Why are you pushing me over there? You're too close to me. It's the light mice. Um, so basically we go around every morning and I feel that we need some kind of respect for that or some kind of accolade. I really do feel that I need to get this virally. I need to get this virally out there. Could you not come closer to me? What do you want me to do? Come but closer or push me away? I'm walking But you're to... pushing me away yeah, so but... I don't know what it is you want. Just because tell me. you I'm need to good stay director. from me. Drew, I thought you were a good director. That's why you went to Stay film that school Stay that distance from me. Sometimes it's really hard for me to get back in the flow after you're so rude. I mean, really. Pick up the poo. Hold this poo. Holy honesty. Just when I'm in mid flow, they seem to know. Stop. I'm really not in the mood. For your Do it slowly. Attitude. Do it slowly. Slowly. Don't softly. Don't tell me how to pick up poo. I'm getting really tired of you getting. Tell me how to pick up poo. But do it slowly. Slowly. Oh, Drew, fuck off. <laughs> slowly. Cut it now. I'm out the mode. Do that. What do you mean? 
me my fucking breath. Breath? Have you been smoking? Yeah, I've had a little cigarette or two. Yeah, of course, you do that oh. with drink, as you do. Oh. What's the problem? What's wrong? What's wrong? Oh. Yeah. Huh? Off me, off me, smell of B.O. <laughs> it's manly, like you like. You are such a man. That's what you like to be in the beginning. Oh. Now all of a sudden you think you're fucking flancy fancy. Off me. Huh? Off me. Off you? Off me. Yeah, that's what you want, is it? Ah, come on. Oh, get oh, off me. Give me a look. Alright, if that's the way you feel, fair enough. Oh, fuck you. If that's what you want, fine. I'm going to help myself. I'm sleeping like right. I just grabbed it with a handful of grass. <laughs> now he's doing another one. <laughs> Do it slowly. I've already taken him for a poo this morning, two hours ago. So wonderful. The weather's beautiful today for a winter's day. Okay, subscribers, I'd like to show you to the most serene, beautiful place. No, I can't film into the sun. Well, tell me, you're the director. There. Sakes. So, viewers. Viewers, this is the most beautiful, serene part of College's River, where we often come with the Brisbane, babies. It, this is actually called Brisbane River. This is part of the Brisbane River, but we're on College's Crossing. Yeah, but you say Don't College's... Don't interrupt me unnecessarily. You say College's River. You know how hard it is for me to get back into the mode? This is really a beautiful place where we sometimes go skinny dipping. Just like Virginia Wolf. I take off my clothes and I walk gradually and slowly into the lake over there. And I just want to show you how beautiful it is and why people find it necessary. This is why I want to highlight the problem. Why people find it necessary to leave such garbage and rubbish around that ultimately could kill marine life. And as well as that, aesthetically, as, no, as well as that aesthetically, it just is not very pretty. or not, whether they should be pulled down, whether they kill birds in the air. Oh, it's so important as it compares to, to watch? our equality, Did you want to our watch? liberty and freedom. Well, doesn't it not matter to you, did considering you? our marriage means absolutely nothing in the state of Queensland? Does that not matter? But did you not want to watch it then? <coughs> Switch the channel when you're talking. So I like I to discuss, it. I like to debate with my partner <gasps> in between. But no, that's, that's not possible, is it? But do you realise what kind of a state we've moved to in Queensland? There's still a gay panic law that exists, okay, where a straight man could potentially get away with murder, claiming that a gay man sexually molested him. Do you not, are you not interested in your new environment? Does it not bother you? No. Does it not bother you that we're just de facto oh, and our marriage means policy. nothing? <laughs> Why should I be surprised? Nothing surprised me. I'll tell you what, let's just turn the TV off, shall we? Yeah. Let's do what we haven't done in a long time. Come on, let's have a little smooch. It's been a long time since we've had a smooch. Oh no, actually I'm a bit tired, so let me just go. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think I'm going. No, I'm, I'm a bit tired. Yeah, fine. Oh, yeah. 
had an exhausted day watching cartoons. It must be very exhausting. I just want to show you where I do Virginia Wolf sometimes, or I used to, three years ago. And I'll walk into the lake <laughs> and just sunbathe. Beautiful. Drew, why don't you tell me that I'm holding dog's poo with me as I'm walking along? It's not... <gasps> you dropped the other bag. I can't show that to my viewers. You dropped the other bag. She's wiping her ass. On the mud. Now we're Stop, gonna... Holly. I'm going to have to clean her before she goes in the home. Now, this is exactly my point. This is exactly the problem here, is that no one adheres to the rules. No one pays any attention to what's right behind them, emblazoned on a big iron ball like this. Take your rubbish with you, people. It doesn't take too much time to pick it up and put it in one of the many bins around us. Subsequently, during the floods a few months back, where the whole bridge was flooded over, all of the rubbish in the bins were all over the place. <laughs> so then you shouldn't be putting it in the bins. <laughs> no, but, but what I'm, don't contradict me, okay? Because what I'm saying is if you don't put them in the bins, they will also be all over the place, as well as the stuff that comes out from the bins. So it is very important, <laughs> people. You... So please, is all I'm saying, for those who live here, I know the, the video is going to go viral, perhaps, and maybe many of those viewers will be from Australia and from um, this part of the woods. So please, comply Why with the Why are you the talking rules. about wood? I don't know where to turn or what to say, but please Lord Ganesha, I know that I am four part Indian. I'm not quite the real McCoy, but I would like you to shine your light on me and let me know exactly what it is I have to do. I'm asking, I'm imploring you to give me some advice. I don't really believe in religion, I'm agnostic. I especially don't believe in God with a big long white beard looking over us. <laughs> so very much I would like to believe in an elephant that presides over us. This is why I chose you, Lord Ganesha, to show me the light. My partner does not want anything to do with me. He does not appreciate my advances. He declines every move I make. He doesn't want my affection. Please, with the help of my dream catcher, will you enlighten me as to what I must do because my partner, he does not want to know me anymore. And I need to know what I can do to win him back. I need to win his affection back. I am begging you, Lord Ganesha. Tell me what I have to do to win my man back, please, I beg of you. I told you that you'll get some affection when you stop all this bull. Here's a prime example, okay? I really didn't want to see this today in one way because it's not very nice for the environment. But in another way, I really did want to see it because I want to show to you people just what the problem is we face here. Here you find plastic bags and bin beer, I'll edit that, beer cans. And so obviously it's a man who's been sat here with his fishing tackle.
it's not very nice. Why are you being sexist? So why? Maybe so, it's a woman. So what I usually do is I'll get one of my own dog poo bags and I put it around my hands to pick it up because I don't want to catch no horrible diseases. Germs. This is all it takes, guys. It really isn't too much effort at all. Okay, it takes one second to wrap it around something and tie it up and put it in the nearest bin. Okay, so thanks, guys. I really do hope that I raise awareness to this huge epidemic. And I'll see you all soon with my next video. I'm clocking out now. Thank you, Barry. medieval coat. It's got mold all over it from the last house. How are we gonna get that out? Huh? I don't know how to touch it. Why are these houses that we rent in Australia so fucking moldy and damp? I can't believe this. I did not know the full magnitude of this problem. Look at my cashmere robe. Cashmere's all gone. Oh my god, that's ruined. I got that from Harris. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps. Oh my god, I put this in the washroom and he's turning away. I can't taste that. Oh my god, the 1970s retro jacket that made me look like Prince. Fuck, ah, it's ruined. Oh, look at the buttons on it. That house has cost us a oh, fortune. Did it touch me? I can't deal with it. I can't deal with it. Have you got me that in the washing machine? No, I'm going to have to pay extortion to the mouse to get that dry clean. I just can't afford it this week. Oh I think God. we should just um, oh my spray, God. spray bleach on it. It's it's just because it for work, it's got mold and crap all over oh, it. Oh, God's sake. Oh, the poor... Look at this. Look, I just can't do it. Oh, there's a creepy crawly on there. There's some kind of a funnel whip spider. Oh, no, I'm sorry. No, I don't need oh. armor. I don't want no spider coming back and trying to kill us. I don't want to rent no more houses out in the country. Oh, I'm oh, getting all goosebumps. Thank you. Oh, my God. Me. Okay, well... Uh, uh, you see in the jacket. Oh, my God, you bought this in the 70s or your father did, not he? Oh, that's beautiful. I love it. It's back in fashion. No, you can't put that in the wash either. Why well, I can't take oh, it Oh, my God, it's sweet. Oh my god. I can't take it. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so filthy. It's explicit. <laughs> Drew? Are you still washing? Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm getting so turned on with this book you bought me. Drew! Drew! Situation. No. Really no. Come on. Under the sun near the lake, what could be more beautiful and romantic, Drew? As nature conservation conservationists, we can't trespass the nature. We're not trespassing. We're allowed here. Okay, maybe we're not allowed to make it up, but you know, who's watching? There's no one here. It's early in the morning. The nature is watching us. Drew, will you stop killing the passion? Okay, I'm fed up of having sex indoors. I like it outside. I was born to be outside. I'm bohemian. Let me just see this beautiful view. What the fuck are those? Those were your national health glasses you got when you lived in England. Yeah, they oh. still work. Oh my god, they're so cool. I really do think they are quite cool. Oh, look, what a beautiful place to lay down and take me. I'm offering you this one chance outside with the nature. If you're not going to take it, I'm just going to move on. Oh, are you going to say yes or no? I'm, no, I'm just tired the of standing is here. watching us. We can't. Oh, Jesus. Anyway, I'm not interested now. You can say can. I'm just looking at the beautiful view. I don't think 
think so, mate. I need to clean oh, hands for today. Dirty, what do you mean it's fucking dirty? I thought we did a wash the other day. Oh, fuck. Huh? They all stink. I'm wearing that. That's mine later. Alright. And this shirt, this is my shirt. That is my shirt. That's my Ben Sherman. I bought that? it. What? What do you mean you bought it? I bought that. What are you trying to take fucking clothes away from me all the time? Don't you think you've got enough? You brought with you three bags of okay, clothes this is mine. Huh? This should go no, this side. I've got that. I got that five years ago, okay? No, you did it. You can't see no, huh? In you London. Can't see no. <laughs> 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 I thought that in London, Ted Baker. Mate, give it a fucking oh, cheap fucking thing. So anyone anyway, need to clean pair of hands? Clean. Okay, that's Why is this on you? Yeah. It's more important for me today. That's my fuck off. Close the windows, people can see it. So, wait, I can't wear that. anything then. I've got to wear these today, it's more important for me, alright? Because I've got fucking me. Well, this these is that, I've got that in London. I've got that one in London this five years ago. Mine. I got that one in London five years no, ago. It's not. Give me that, right? That's my shirt. No, that's my shirt. That is my Do you really want to do this? You want to do it? <laughs> 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 no, you think it's such a lie. You think such a lad, you stick, you stick like B.O. No. Yeah, get off me syndrome, huh? <laughs> you think you're so tough, don't you? Yeah. Um, oh. You think you're so tough, but you're not, you're not so tough. Wait, you just want my fucking nuts. <laughs> what are you doing? Get your fucking freakishly strong elbows off my chest, you freak. Huh? <sighs> get off. <sighs> Get off! Oh, fuck my nuts! Get off! Get off! Get it's off! Just squash my nuts! Oh, you bring me closer to you. <sighs> Is this finally going to happen then? I don't think so, mate. We're too similar. You're like my brother. Get off. You're not gonna get a raise out of me. Yeah.